So, in this class uh, we are going to see the half adder, what actually it is a half adder is and we will realize it on the breadboard using the ICs. So, half adder adds two bits A plus B, A plus B, A and B two bits to generate a sum, a sum and a carry a sum and a carry it adds two bits suppose you are adding a number say a decimal number 53 and say 24 so while adding you just add two bits two bits that is 3 and 4 what uh, what is the sum generated while adding you get 7 and what is the carry carry is 0 and sum is sum equal to 7 okay this is uh, an example uh, of decimal addition so similar in similar manner we just add the binary bits also so say when 0 is added with 0 okay two bits are added the sum is 0 say these are the two bits a and b sum is 0 carry is 0 when 0 is added with 1 the sum is 1 the carry is 0 and 1 is added with 0 the sum is 1 and carry is 0 similarly when 1 is added to 1 in this case the sum is the sum is 0 and the carry is 1 so the sum is 0 and the carry is 1. This is the truth table of a half adder. This is truth table for half adder where these two are the inputs, input bits and this is the output. Sum and carry are the output. Outputs. Sum and carry are the outputs. Sum and carry these are the two inputs input bits these are these two are sum and carry these are the output and these are the inputs that you are providing so in order to devise a logic first uh, you have to uh, transform this outputs outputs say here in case sum and carry as function of inputs so you will have to devise sum equal to a function of a function of a and b so similarly carry carry as a function of a and b so what you have to do is first 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 what we do is we transform it into two separate functions because we have two separate output output bits so we'll we'll have to get two separate output functions for some we can see that for some we can see that it is giving output 1 when a is 0 b is 1 or a is 1 and b is 0 so it is giving output at when a is 0 and b is 1 or when a is 1 and b is 0 b is 0 so we get here a function for sum as a x or b a x or b similarly for carry if we see for carry if we see carry we are getting output as 1 if and only if both the inputs are both the input bits are 1 so we just write carry equal to a dot b so now that we have obtained a function for sum a function for sum and carry we will just try to implement it on uh, first we will try to implement it on the ic and then uh, using the ic we will be physically realizing it on the breadboard
so if we denote uh, um, say sum if you want to make a circuit for this sum and the carry bits so we will have sum for sum a b we have to place an xor gate xor gate sum and for carry sum this one is carry this one is carry so we have obtained sum as well as carry so now see uh, since um, half adder circuit will be somewhat will be this one so which ic uh, number will have to use for xor gate that is 7486 and for AND gate 7408 AND gate it is 7408 and for this it is 7486 7486 suppose here we have given A now here we ha will have to give B and this one C it will be sum it will be the sum output right now for carry carry we will have a mm, you just take this uh, points from here a similarly b b just take it from here b right just connect it to here b and this one is the carry carry this one is the carry uh, do not forget to give uh, vcc over here and vcc to this ic also and ground to this ic as well as ground to this ic this is must you will you'll have to supply right so this is the circuit diagram for half adder now suppose if you want to put the pin diagrams uh, pin numbers over here you will have to place 74 i for 7486 ic pin number 1 pin number 2 over here and this is uh, pin number 3 output you can get it at pin number 3 right suppose we we have just circled the pin numbers for 7408 ic for pin number 1 and pin number 2 output can be obtained from pin number 3 you can you can use the uh, since we have used the first gates of both the ICs so we have taken pin number 1 and 2 here also pin number 1 and 2 you can use any of the gates any of the gates in this uh, in this circuit uh, in this IC any of the gates like uh, you can use this gate also you can use this gate or uh, any of the four gates in the above IC as well as in the 7408 IC. This one is 747408 and this IC is 7486.